For I know the thoughts that I think toward you. God is aware of how he's thinking about us. That's a whole different area to go down, but I was put a pin there. We need to be aware of how we're thinking too. Right. Toward God and also toward people right. and toward ourselves. Yeah. You know, some of us are really good at encouraging others, but would you encourage yourself? Really good at blessing others, would you bless yourself? Really good at speaking highly of others, but will you speak highly of yourself in line with what's the thinking in the will of God? Even though it is somehow different where you are today or your experience, will you purpose to think like God? Because unless we do that, then the song we sing like a moment ago, that the goodness of God is running after us. We say, it ain't running after me. It's about how we think. Say it's about how we think. For I know the thoughts that I think toward you, says the Lord. Thoughts of peace and not of evil. God, I'm going to stop there and go home. You know what? God thinks peace thoughtful thoughts about me and you. And no evil. Say no evil. No evil. Say no evil. no evil. That's another confirmation. There's many in Scripture. One confirmation. This is powerful. God not into killing people. Amen. He's not a murderer. Amen. The thief is that. Right. Satan. He's not taking my loved one and my baby. His thoughts are not what? Evil. Let's settle on this a minute. We got to get it. Can we hear sometimes from preachers talk about it? God took your husband. He was 45 years old, got three kids. He was a major breadwinner. Now she's in poverty, the wife. And God did that? No. But sometimes that's talked about. But there's no evil. Say no evil. You don't have no evil thoughts toward us. And sometimes the struggle we have as Christians, we got to become more biblically thinking. That's right. Amen. And force ourselves to believe what God says, otherwise we won't have what God says. That's right. No judgment, we just judge ourselves and make the appropriate mid-course corrections. Amen? Amen? But there's a reason why we should think like God. Amen. I'm going to get to that in a minute. In a minute. There's a good reason, because his stars are peaceful. I want more peace in my life. <laughs> We're going to read further. For I know the thoughts that I think toward you, says the Lord, thoughts of peace and not evil. I don't have no evil thoughts about my, my, my family, about myself, about my wife and congregation. To give you a future and a hope. Say future and a hope. Future. So God's thoughts toward me are for peace, no evil, and for a future, say a future. future. And a hope, say and a, hope. and a hope. So I can have a future, but it may not be good. But he makes it clear, a hope, something you look forward to. Oh, yeah, yeah. So he gives you a future you can look forward to. You can be excited about. Yeah, yeah. That's how God thinks about you. So God is saying, think about you like I think about you. This will help you fight against sickness and disease. Mm 